Creatures of all sizes and shapes have roamed our planet for millions of years. Most are long gone, hunted to extinction, or lost to a changing world. But our ancestors, mammals, survive. They begin as small mouse-like creatures dominated by predatory giants. Then, 65 million years ago, their world turns upside down, and mammals begin their rise to the top in life after dinosaurs. In the American Southwest, New Mexico's Chinle Formation shelters a tiny fossil that would forever change our understanding of mammals. Paleontologist Adrian Hunt's discovery of Adela Basilius is the find of a lifetime. You can tell from this tiny skull that the living animal was no bigger than a mouse. But this tiny skull was the starting point for all mammals, including humans like us. The fossil reveals a creature less than five inches long that first appeared nearly 225 million years ago. It's the oldest known mammal, and we can trace our roots and more than 5,000 mammalian species to Adela Basilius. Adela Basilius first appears when our planet is one giant continent, Pangaea. Amphibians and reptiles are the dominant animals living with newly arrived dinosaurs and mammals. Creatures like the 15-foot-long plant-eating Desmatosuchus Adela Basilius appears at about the same time as Coelophysis, one of the earliest dinosaurs. To avoid predators, mammals live in the shadows for safety, but sometimes there's no escape. First, Coelophysis has the upper hand in the evolutionary competition between dinosaurs and mammals. 